Well, as I just said, and if you know me in real life, you know that I say this all the time, Found Informed Shop in Czech Village is one of my most favorite places to shop. So I'm very glad that one of the owners, Abigail Rawson, agreed to join <laughs> us today on Everyday Iowa. Hi, thank you for being Hi, here. Thank you. And for bringing a set of <laughs> things I want to buy. <laughs> of course, happy to. So I frequent the shop a lot, but for those who haven't been, tell us what is Found Informed. Okay, so Found Informed is a vintage clothing store in the Czech Village that I started in 2016. Uh, we specialize in vintage clothing from like the 1950s through the 1990s. We go a little bit older and a little bit more modern, but I would say primarily 50s through 90s. We have some handmade things. Uh, we're size inclusive. That's like my number one priority. Um, and we sell menswear, kids. Yes, you, oh yeah, you do have kids Little and kids. you do have men's, which sometimes I find great things in that section too. Same. <laughs> Same. So when did your love for vintage begin? When and where? Okay, so my parents are, were um, teachers turned antique dealers. And so I was born wearing vintage clothing and just surrounded myself with old things all the time. and. Um, yeah, I was wearing vintage as long as I can remember. And I'm sure your son wears vintage now, too. <laughs> as much as I can put him in, yeah. yeah. He's three, so. <laughs> and how do you collect inventory for the store? Um, primarily from people in the community. People coming in and saying, oh, well, I have old clothes like this in my closet. Um, and then we set up an appointment. Maybe I come over to their house. Maybe they come to me. Mm -hmm. That's my favorite way to buy, because I love to hear the stories of where things came from, how they were made, why they were purchased, for what event, and then it getting them. It them special. It makes them so special. Yes. I've seen you at estate sales. <laughs> yes. and, if you, and so if somebody does want to make an appointment, should they call the store? Yep, you can call me, um, call at the shop, and we can set something up. Yes, and I think I have a graphic with the phone number, but you also can go to their website or their Instagram, Facebook, and find all of their information, or Google Maps has all of that on there. Yeah. So do you have any other projects you're working on? Well, we just expanded into the Iowa City market. We're selling vintage clothing at our friend Allison's shop called Heim, which is downtown Iowa City. Uh, we currently have four racks, but next week we're debuting a full basement full. <gasps> so we're really expanding this week. It's very exciting. <laughs> we'll see we're actually going to have a party on the 11th. You're hearing it here first. Oh, the 11th mm -hmm. in Iowa City yep. at Heim. At Heim. Okay. Ooh, fun. And let's see. We're um, also offering styling services. If you want to come into the shop, I would love to help you find stuff. It's totally free of charge. Just let me know you're coming, and I'd love to help you find vintage. A lot of what we hear is that, well, vintage isn't in my size, or you don't have anything in my size, and I just think that's not true. Um, we need to just work together and find stuff. Yeah. And I yeah, know, yeah. and you're great at it. I'm wearing my dresses from Found and Form. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and yeah, I have a lot of clothes I've worn on the show and will wear from Found and Formed. So, and so anyone who's looking for a last minute Halloween outfit, you also have some suggested costume ideas there. Yes, we do. I feel like vintage is a really fun place to start with um, Halloween costumes. And so we do have a rack of inspiration if you need a place to start. Um, we have like a little Barbie section, a Western section, a hippie section rock and roll, all sorts of fun stuff. Yes, and of course Barbie is so popular. Now you have pink galore. I'm sure you had a lot of people coming in looking for pink. I'm obsessed <laughs> with it, I love that it. That movie really brought that color back. <laughs> I don't, didn't need to be brought back. But right. <laughs> it inspired me to wear more pink yes. though, for sure. What is your favorite era of vintage? Oh, um, ooh, I love anything with a story. I wouldn't say it's like an era necessarily, but Anything with a really rich history, yeah. I like. So I love that. Yeah. That's very cool. And make sure you go and visit Abigail and everyone else at Found and Form. They're great. They'll help you find something you'll love. And they're in Czech Village. They're open Tuesday through Sunday. Yeah, thank you, Abigail, for being here. Thank you for I will me. sure see you this weekend when I go shopping. Can't wait. <laughs> I'll see you then. Well, don't go away.